Welcome to the world of tomorrow! Um, yes, why am I comfortable recording a video for the 31st of December 2023 and putting it into my uh, 2024 video series? Because it wasn't released until the 1st of January 2024. Because I'm in Australia and we're in the future. 2024 so far has been loud. Um, anyway, so this is the um, genuinely approachable Sudoku for the 31st of December 2023, and it is a zipper lines puzzle by Clover. Um, before I get onto the puzzle, um, there are a couple of shout outs I want to do, which were the ones that Clover collected um, in the Discord. The first one is to 90 degrees, um, which was 1400 lifetime party hats. That's cool and valerie172 who got their first single hat so um that's really cool someone who's obviously uh improving awesome um this is the message from clover that came with this video so happy birthday 2023 it's a shame to see you go me pers bremster butting in it's not 2023 was a terrible year. It's a shame to see you go as I t as you turn one, but I'm sure 2024 will be a very sweet baby who always sleeps through the night and doesn't involve any horrific diseases, political unrest, or bad puzzles. It's going to see all of that stuff. Today's guest is a zipper line Sudoku. Again, we're excited about zipper lines here at HQ. Um, you all just did this the other day, so here's a refresher on the rules. Um, I'll go through the rules in a minute. If you get a dinosaur, you get a Zapdig Zapalosaurus. So, okay. So this is the zipper lines puzzle. I have a second window where I can read the text and then I switch back to the puzzle. There's no point trying to show you the text. It is messy. Anyway, so um, zipper lines by Clover. So normal Sudoku rules apply. There are some, um, which I, first video in the series, I'll go through it just quickly. So in every box, in every row and in every column, the goal is to put the digits one to nine without any repetition. Any puzzle that is normal Sudoku, I will not go through that again. <coughs> then I'll have a heart attack and die. Okay, there are some lines in the grid, each of which has an odd length. Not a requirement for zipper lines, but in this puzzle it is true. Um, the digits in the exact center of the line represents a sum, and each pair of cells that are the same distance from the center of the line sum to the value in the center. For instance, if a six appears in the middle of the line, such as there, um, then the line could read one, four, six. Well, okay, if it was longer than this. But um, if this was a one, this would could be a five because they would sum to the six in the middle. These two digits and these two digits have the, um, these two digits have the same sum as these two digits which have the same sum as that digit. And it's the same is true along all of the lines. Um, I'm very, very new to zipper lines. I may have only solved half a dozen puzzles and I'm not very good at them, but we'll see how we go. I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. Let's give this a shot. Four and one are equidistant from the middle, so this is a five. Three and five are equidistant from the middle, so this is an eight. Three is the, the sum, so these are all one twos. So this here, if my mouse works, is a one, this is a two, and this is a one. Now, these are, um, do, 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 do. okay, uh, where I want to look. This two makes this a three. These have to sum to five, so they're one, four, or two, three. Uh, they could be in either order. So this is one, four, or two, and this is one, four, or three, and I'm not sure. This has to be higher than six. So this is seven or nine, because if this was an eight, this would be six, two, and it can't be. So this is a one or a three. Um... This is this is higher than five. So this is seven, eight, or nine, and it can't be seven because then this would have to be the two. So this is eight or nine, so this is three or four. Now, ways of making eight. One, seven, yes, two, six. So this is the one or a two because um, I can't put a one or a two here. So this is one or two. Three, five is not possible. So this is six or seven. Now, the six is here. Ooh, not sure, not sure, not sure, not sure. Actually, this is easy. This is a two, three. Uh, and this two means this is the three and this is the two, which takes the two out of here and the three out of here. The two makes this the one, which makes this the seven. It looks back making that the four and that the one. Now, this six is possibly more restricted now. Not sure, though. Not sure at all. Because one five would be five one two four. Oh, I can't do two four. This is one and five. Okay. Now these have three options because they could repeat three. Uh, I can't repeat three. So 
if it's one five, I, ca I can't do one five because I can't put one in either of them. I can't do three three. So this is two four. So this is two, this is four. Now I've got triples everywhere. Do I want to look into those triples? One, two, three, four, five, six. So this is seven, eight, nine. So this is nine. This is eight. This is seven. The eight means this is three. Now these triples, one, two, three, four, five, six. These are seven, eight, nine. This isn't seven. This isn't eight. Okay. So it's probably this. I'm going to look at this triple first. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two, four, six. There's no two there. There's no two there. This is the two. Okay, eight can be one, seven. It can't, well, this can't be one, seven. It can't be two, six. So this is three, five because of that two. So this is the three. This is the five. These now, one, seven. I can't put one in either of them. I can't put two in either of them. I can't put three in either of them. So those are two fours. Now, this is a triple. Well, that being a four means that's the six and that's the four. This is, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So six, seven, and nine. This is the six because of the seven, nine. I take six out of those. This is a seven, nine pair. This is a very cool puzzle. I'm doing it slowly. One, two, three, four, five, and eight. So this is the eight. This is the five. What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and nine. Now I'm not putting nine on the length of a zipper line because the other end would have to it have to go nine nine zero. So that's not going to work. This isn't set. This is a six. So I can take six out of the, that's just by Sudoku. This is the nine by Sudoku. So I can take the nine out of those. So this is one, two, three, four. So what are these? One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two, eight, and nine. Well, there's no two there. So this is the two. So this is a six. So this has to be seven, eight, or nine. And this is one, two, three. So this is the two. This is the eight. This triple. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one, five, seven. There's no five there. There's no one or five there. That's seven. That's one. That's five. I'm doing this badly. What are these? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and nine. There's no seven there. These are six, seven, eight, nine. Well, that's an eight. So these are six, seven, nine. I'm not putting nine on a zipper line. So this has to be higher than this. This is seven, eight, nine. It's not seven or eight. This is a nine. So this is one, two, or three, and it's not two. So it's one or three. They're giving me a one three pair in the box. So actually it can't be a one because this can't be an eight. So this is a three, this is a six, this is a one, meaning this is a seven. The six takes six out of here. The seven nine pair maybe? No, this nine makes this the six, takes six out of here, and then I've got seven nine pairs all over the place. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and I know the order. So one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There is no two or four there. That's the three. I take three out of there. The four makes this the two and this the four. I'm solving this as if it's a normal video and I'm not speed solving. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I know the order, eight and nine, which makes that seven, which makes that nine, which makes that seven, which makes this nine, which makes this seven, which takes seven out of there. This is in fact an eight, which makes that nine and that eight. The one looks up making that seven and one. I should be speed solving, but uh, I'm having fun. One, two, three, four, and nine. So I can go nine and four. This row is missing one, two, three, four, seven. These, or this row is missing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and nine. And these are one, two, three, and six. And I'll use the six to make that the three and that the six. And that's six minutes, 29 with explaining. Which means I got the two party hat time by one second with explanation. I'll take it. Um, I'm going to sign off now. Um, I, I normally actually, mm, I'm going to do this and normally I wouldn't because this is going to come before the chapter break. So over on, on my channel, 
Um, I'm currently running a thing over on my free Patreon, which is the um, best of 2023. It's just a bit of fun, um, a, a user voted or a viewer voted thing. Um, but over on my Patreon, which is available for free, there is a nomination page where people can vote on the best videos, uh, best puzzles that were featured as videos on my channel. If you're interested in participating in that, please jump over to my Patreon, join for free, and there'll be a nomination form there that you'll be able to find. Um, people who are paid Patreons can do slightly more. I normally don't promote too much about my channel on this, but it is a bit of fun I'm running that people may want to engage with. I also do, um, I'm doing um, genuinely approachable Sudoku streaming quite regularly, so we'll see how that goes as well. Thank you everyone for watching, um, and I'm not going to sign off because that was dumb of me, because there's going to be more videos from 2024. Um, see you then. I just signed off, didn't I? Okay, and now we're doing the puzzle for the 1st of January 2024, which is called Nshing Lily or something by Bill Murphy. Here's the message from Bill. Happy New Year from all of us at Gas HQ. Between you and me, it's a bit... Uh, I'm a bit tired from the celebration, so if we could just pretend I wrote something funny here, that'd be nice. Today's guess is a betweens lines Sudoku. If you get a dinosaur, you get an, a, uh, an exhausted Europelta. So, um, puzzle, between lines. So, again with the contrast. Okay, so um, the way it works is on these lines, the, um, so uh, I've already described normal Sudoku rules, on digits on lines must be strictly between the digits in the circles at the end of the lines. Um, so yeah, I'll be able to explain that when I solve it. So I'm going to restart the puzzle, restart my timer. Let's give this a shot. So these must be between two and five. So they are three and four. This must be between one and four. So they are two and three. And I know the order. This is the three. This is the two. Uh, between two and five. So these are three and four. Between four and nine. There's a lot of options there. Five and eight. So these are six, seven. Five, six, seven, eight. Um, uh, five and eight. These are six and seven. Four and nine, six and nine. So these are seven and eight, and I know the order. Seven and eight. So that means this the six and this the seven. Oh, the three of course makes this the four and this the three. Um, now four. These are from five, six, seven, and eight. There's no five, six there. This is from seven and eight. There's an eight there that makes this the seven. There's no seven there. There's no eight there. Um, so this is five or six. Uh, okay. So, what am I looking at? Nine is right here. Um, oh, these. These are from two, three, four, five. There's no two, four, or five there. That's the three. I can take three out of there. I can take two out of there. This is from four or five. So, I know one is right here. So, one in this column is at the bottom. Nine in this column is at the top. This is four, five, or six, and there's the four and a six. So I put a five in the middle, which makes that the four and that the six. This is a triple one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's no two there. Oh, there's no three in there. That's the way I should have looked at it. So that's the three. This is a two, five, and I know the order. Uh, this is a pair one, two, three, four, and six, and I know the order six and four. One, two, three, four, five, seven, and eight but the seven comes out of those. So that's the seven, the five makes this the eight, and this the five. Um, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two and eight go into those, so eight and two. Um, now these are quadruples. So what have, I mis uh, what have I got? I've got to put an eight here, which means these are one, two, three, four, five, seven, one, seven, and nine. So this becomes the two. Uh, the, this becomes the seven by Sudoku. Uh, not sure about the one and nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, three and nine. The one and the nine makes this the three and the three comes out of these. I quite like the symmetry on this one. Okay, so up in this row, maybe one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, four, seven, nine. Um, there's no four there. There's no seven there. Okay, maybe that wasn't it. And this is going to be symmetrically just as useless, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one, three, six. There's no six there. There's no three there. Okay. This is probably just a scanning fail of an invisible given or something. Um, 
So one, two. So in this box, I need to put one, three, four, or it's just one, two, three, four. So this is three or four. There's no three up here. So these are one, two, four. There's no one there. Five, six. So these are two, three, four, and eight. So this is three or eight. Two, three, four, or eight. So this is two or eight. So eight is in one of those two, but I could have seen. Mm. Top row. I need to put two, six, seven, and eight. So this is six or seven. This is two or seven. Right, where's eight in the top row? Right, eight in the top row is there. So this becomes a three. Which means this is the four, this is the two. Which means this is not a two. Now in the bottom row, the question is that I can ask is about two. So the others are now three, four, and eight. So this is the four, this is the eight, this is the three, this is the one, this is the four, which means this is the three which I had. The four looks up taking four out of there. So the seven, nine pair makes that the four. The one of course makes this the nine and this the one, which makes this the seven, this the two, which makes this the nine. This is six or seven. So this is six, this is seven. Um, so one, two, three, four, five, and nine go in, and they should be resolvable. Five, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, and eight. So six and eight, which means seven and six. One and nine. Three. So one, two, three, four, five. These are one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, one, six, and seven. So one, six, seven. There is already one, six here. So the one and six is six and one. So five minutes, 49 seconds. I definitely slowed down right at the end. 6.45 was the two hat time. So made it by just under a minute. Yeah, okay. That was a really nice little between line puzzle. <laughs> Yeah, the between lines basically felt forced, except for the, the 6, 7, and the 3, 4. Very weird little interactions. And then the Sudoku at the end was quite tricky, but it was a nice way to start the Sudoku. So that's what you want from a puzzle, really. Uh, you want a really nice start to the puzzle from the, the variants, and then the Sudoku is cool. So excellent puzzle. Um, I won't say enough. I'll see you tomorrow. Hello everybody and welcome to the middle of the film. Um, today I'm recording the puzzle for the 2nd of January 2024 and it's called, I should look this up, Out With The Old by Philip Newman. Um, this is the message that came with it. Happy New Year gas solvers. My completely original New Year's resolution this year is provide completely original gas for you to solve. Also completely original intros. Hooray! Um, if you, then it's the rules, which I'll get to when I'm looking at the grid. Uh, if you get a dinosaur today, you get a Cinecephapinosaurus. So I have no idea what that means. It's a dinosaur name. <laughs> Woohoo! Um, so rules on this one, normal Sudoku rules, and these are thermos. Along thermos, digits must strictly increase from the bulb, this end, to the tip, this end. So this digit will be higher than this, this digit will be higher than this. So as you go along, all of the digits will go up. I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. Let's give this a shot. I've recently done some of these for 2023 in my streams, but um, let's have... Uh, I'm just going to pencil mark the thermos. Maximum nine, maximum eight, maximum seven, maximum six, maximum five, maximum three, so maximum two. So one, two, two, th uh, two, two, three, three, four, five, four, five, six, five, six, seven, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, nine. I think that's right. So let's do this one. Maximum nine, maximum eight, maximum seven, maximum six, maximum five, maximum four. Uh oh. No, yeah, so one, two, oh no, maximum four here, not maximum five. So one, two, uh, two, three, four, three, four, five, six, 
four, five, six, seven, ugh, five, uh, six, seven, eight, and seven, eight, nine, because there's no five there. But that's well, that's actually a three, four, five, six, seven quintuple. So these, well, this is just a one because I have to put a one in the row somewhere. I should have seen that earlier. So these are two, eight, and nine. Well, it's interesting, I suppose. So eight is on this thermo. Three, four, five, six, seven. Three is in one of those two. So two is in one of those two. So that's a one. That's the two. Which means that's not two, that's not three, that's not four which means three is now here, so this is the two. Four, five, six, seven. Seven is in one of those two. So eight is in one of those two. They're not seeing each other though. But four is in one of those two. Yeah, um, not sure. Let's pencil mark this now. Maximum nine, maximum seven, maximum six, maximum five, maximum, so max three, two, one. So this is four or five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, nine. Oh, this is just five. So six, seven with eight, nine. Three is in one of those two now. Right. Doo -doo. Well, where's one? Uh, one is in one of those two in this column. Well, one in this box. It's not in any of those. They're partway along thermo. There's not there. So one is in one of those two. So one now is in one of those two. One is not here or in any of those, so one is in one of those two. One, one, this is just a one. Two, oh, this is a two. Puts three in one of those two, which puts three up here. Okay. So, what's this? Well, okay, so this, these can't be three, four, five, six. So these have to be from seven, eight, nine, because they can't be one or two. They're too far along thermo. So these are from seven, eight, nine. That one can't be a seven. That's not great for the end of quite short thermos. Is there more chaining going on that I'm just not seeing? I mean, the answer is yes. Yes, there is. And why am I not seeing it? Because I'm not seeing it. Five is in one of those. Six is in one of those, no. Okay, so these are four, five, six, seven. This is the place where weird stuff is happening. If this is six, seven, eight, nine, This becomes four, five, and that opens everything up. I don't understand. This is, seems to be where the chaining is happening, and I can't see it. Oh, this isn't a five anymore. It's not a seven either. This is the six, so it can take six out of all of those. This is a triple. Well, this is the three in the column, and this is a pair. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, four, and nine go down here. The four, five makes this seven, eight, nine, which makes that the two, and I can take two out of there. That makes this seven. So do I want to pencil mark these? I think there's still too many options. This is a triple though. One, two, three, four, five, and nine. Nine is not in any of those. So nine is in one of those two. So that takes nine out of there and puts nine into there, which takes nine out of there, which takes eight out of there. But eight had to be in one of those two. That's cool. 
don't know what it's doing for me, but it's cool. The chains in this are very intricate. Like they're not overly complex, but they're intricate. This is now a seven by Sudoku because that seven knocks it out of those and I can't put seven in anywhere else. So this is a triple. What is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, and eight. There's no six there or there. This is a six. Is the five, eight resolved? Not that I'm seeing. So this now has a maximum of five. So this has to be higher than five. And it's not six. So it's seven, eight, or nine. And this is, it can't be two. So this is three, four, five. And this is one, two, three, four. It's not two. Ugh. Two is in one of those two. Because that two means it can't be there. So these are one, two, eight, nine. So this is one or nine because it can't be two or eight. One, two, eight, nine. Uh, it's two, eight, nine. Oh, it can't be eight or nine. So this C is one, eight, or nine. This is the two. So this is one, eight, or nine. Does that two do anything? It puts two in, uh, puts two right in the corner, which puts two right here. Three is in one of those two now. Three, it's in one of those three. This is crazy. What is it? Oh, this is the one because of the eight, nine. So this is the nine. This is the eight. This is the nine. This is a three, four pair. And that being a three, four pair, if I can get my pencil marks correct, I'm not doing very quickly on this. This is the five. This is the eight. This is the five. This is a three, four pair. The nine makes this the eight. This isn't the one. This is the one. This is the five. What are these? One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. The seven in the bottom looks up. So this is a three or a four. These are all three, four, six. So this is a three, four. This is the place I can put a six in the box. I'm going to look at this pair. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That gives me a four, five pair in this. Oh, and this five makes that the four, that the five, that the four, which takes four out of there, which isn't restricting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and nine go in. There's no seven there. What? How am I still so lost? Oh, this five makes this four. I could have used that five as well. So these are three, six, seven, and nine. There's no seven or nine there. So this is three or six. There's no six here. Oh, there's no nine in either of those. Yeah, the nine had to be over here. I could see that by Sudoku. Three, six, or three, seven... I am not getting a good time on this puzzle. This is atrocious. <sighs> so, five down here is in one of those two. No. <sighs> Nowhere looks weak. One, two, three. 
maybe I need to install the mark tool, which is you push a button and it puts all the valid candidates in. I mean, I see a lot of people solve with that. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven go into those. Well, there's no five or six there. So that's four or seven. There's no seven there. There's no six there. Have I made a mistake here? If this is four, five, like this doesn't seem to restrict anything. This is, oh, the six, the six made that seven. That happened ages ago. This, the seven takes seven out of both of those. This becomes the seven. This is the four. This is the five. This is the six. This is the three. That happened ages ago. That was just me being blind. Four, three. Now, what does that do? The three comes out of both of those. So this is the five. This is not a three. This is a one, four pair, which can be either. The five means this isn't the five. This is the five. This is the one. This is the four. This is the one. This is the nine. This is the four. These are one, two, three, four, three, and eight. The only place I can put three in the box is there because of that. So these are seven, eight, nine. There's no seven there. There's no seven or eight there. That's the nine. That's the eight. That's the seven. The three makes that the eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. I just missed that thermo. I was realizing I've got to look at a thermo or something. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's a nine, which means this is a six. This is a nine. The eight looks up making that the nine and that the eight. 1231, I, that. How could I miss that for so long? We know how I could miss that for so long. I'm me. Wow. Okay, 12.31, which... Wow. Okay, that was within the two hat time. Actually, it was only... It was only, what, uh, three minutes outside the two hat time. But I didn't get it in the time. Sorry, this is going to be a long video. Yeah, I struggled a little with that one. I was actually, anecdote time, I was talking to a family member from another country um, who I haven't seen in years um, yesterday, and she's a Sudoku fan. Um, and um, I was explaining this community to her, and she was saying, so how do I get started in this? And I was re recommending, okay, I can send you some intro puzzles and all of that sort of stuff. She said she only does really New York Times puzzles and sort of killer that she buys in books in news agents. And um, I do this puzzle and I, we were talking about the sort of deductions that she's used to and everything. And I do this puzzle and it was like, I did kind of recommend the gas puzzles and I do this and I go, if she hit this, she'd probably just want to stop. And I, it always, where do you, how do you start people off with these? Because the gas puzzles aren't made for people to start off as introductory, how you learn Sudoku. It used to be that for a while, but it's not anymore. And finding puzzles for people who are like, oh, I'm interested in this. How do I start? We we don't cater to those people and I can't do it on my own, though I kind of try, but we just don't make puzzles for them. Anyway, that was my family discussion yesterday. It was a nice way to spend a, a family, um, some family time. They, the, the guest people get to write, say a message. So do I. Uh, see you tomorrow. Okay, now the video for the 3rd of January 2024, and this is called Pair Up Sudoku by Clover. This is the message that came with it. There's a little soap opera ha happening in today's gas, if you look closely. And looking closely looks a lot, feels a lot like scanning. Why would I do that? Desperate and lonely sight, uh, desperate and lonely eights, having nearly abandoned the search for true love, still holding on to the last vestige of hope that the perfect two might come along. Sixes and ones bitterly f feuding over fours, and who will finally crack five's stern facade and convince them to admit that they need to pair up after all? This is a pair up Sudoku. Normal Sudoku rules apply. I'm reading the rules here because I'm not sure if the ones in the puzzle are going to be just as detailed. Um, also, each digit, except for five, has at least one neighbor that pairs with it to sum to either five or ten. For instance, every four is orthogonally adjacent to at least one and uh, at least one one and or at least one six. Okay, uh, if you get a dinosaur today, you earn a paired... Oh, crikey. P 
Pianitsikosaurus. Pianitsikosaurus. Okay, fine. So, each digit except for five has at least one neighbor that pairs with it to sum to either five or ten. So, each digit must have a neighbor that causes it to sum to five or ten. Okay, that's each digit except for five, of course, because it can't sum to five or ten. I'd need a zero or another five. Has at least one neighbor that pairs with it to sum to either five or ten. Okay, restarting the puzzle to restart my timer. Let's give this a shot. An eight and six doesn't, so this has to be a two. Nine and seven doesn't, so this has to be a one. Now, seven doesn't sum. Seven can't ever do five, so seven needs a three. Eight needs a two. And I can't put the two in either of those, so that becomes a two. Now, these, one, two, three, four, five, and eight go into those. Now, the two doesn't get its three in, oh, two's got its eight, so it's fine. Three needs a two or a seven, it's fine. Six needs a four, okay, eight needs, eight needs a two, and I can't put it there, so this is a two. Um, now, two is done, six needs its four. Seven needs a three, and it has to be there. These are one, five, nine. So this is a one by Sudoku. Actually, I should have looked at Sudoku down here, shouldn't I? No, okay. <laughs> mm. um, these are five and nine. Four has got its six. Three has its seven. One has its nine. This is all done. Now, um, okay, in this central box, maybe? Because nine has to go next to a one, and I can't put a one in any of those. So that's the one. Eight needs to go next to a two. I can't put a two in either or any of those three. So that's the two. Seven needs to go next to a three. Right. Six needs to go next to a four. So what's this triple actually? One, two, three, four, one, four, five. So this is a four at the top. I can take four out of those. This is a one, five. Eight has its two. Three needs its, uh, three has its two. What's this triple? One, two, three, five. So this is a three at the bottom. So this is a two, five. Now three needs to go next to either a two or a seven. It could get a two there or a seven there. The high digits are the ones that are the most restricted. I can see that. So eight is in one of those two. If eight was here, it would put a two here. If eight was here, it would put a two. Right, eight is in one of these. But, oh, this is just a two by Sudoku. But, and that is, that one is now fulfilled by whichever, wherever the eight goes. This is nine by Sudoku. Do more Sudoku. Seven is in one of those two, but seven here doesn't work because it's not next to three. So that's not the seven. This is the seven. This is the eight. Seven needs to go next to a three. So this is one, five, nine. It's not nine. So this is five, nine. This is one, which goes next to the four. These are one, two, three, four, and six. Now the four and six... The three here would work because it'd be next to a two. Four, six here would go next to each other. That would be fine. Oh, there's no three in those. Sudoku. So now this is fully fulfilled. This is a pair. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now they don't fulfill each other. So if I was to put a seven here, it would need a three and it wouldn't have one. So this is the six, this is the seven. So this is five, nine. This is a triple. One, two, three, four, five. There's no three in either of those. That's the three. This is the four, this is the five. This is four or six, I think, for the column. Oh, one, two, this is just a three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I have to put a, a seven in here. 
And if I put it in either of those, yeah, seven has to be here to go next to its three. So these are one, four, and six. That one, four, and six. There's no one here. Wow, what am I doing? There's no one here. So this is the one. This is four, six. Now, if that was four, it would have its one. If it's six, it would need a four and it doesn't have one. So this is the four, this is the six. The six needs to go next to a four. So that becomes the four. This is not four. This is two, five or eight. So it's five or eight. This is the two. I am finding this quite tricky, which makes this the five. This is one, two, three, four, five, six and seven. And again, if seven went here, it wouldn't have its three. So that's the seven, that's the six. So these are one with five, eight, it's a one. Now, if I put a, f a five here wouldn't need anything and eight wouldn't be fine. But if I put an eight here, it would have its two. So one, two, three, four, five, I'd need to put a six in here. Six would need to go next to four. And if I put a six here, I can't put a four in any of those. Put a six here, I can't put four in any of those. So this has to be the six. So one, two, three, four, five, eight, and nine. Well, there's no nine there, so that's the nine. Oh, this is just the eight and the five. Of course, where was five in the column? So this is eight, which does have its two. One, two, three, and seven. So this is three by Sudoku. Now seven needs to go next to a, th oh, seven gets its three. Two needs to go next to either a three or an eight, and that's fully fulfilled. So, but the two does it by Sudoku. Two, seven. So these are one, five, nine. There's no one there. So now I've got a five, nine pair, which takes five out of there. Four, eight. Eight needs to go next to two. Hang on, eight, the eight can't get two there. So this is the four, taking four out of there. Eight can't get two around here. So this is the eight, this is the five, which means this is the nine, this is the five, which means this is the nine, this is the five, this is the one. The five makes this nine and five. The six makes this four and six. And now I'm down to a single box and hopefully Sudoku will resolve it. Four, six, seven, and eight. And that is the correct solution. In seven minutes and one second, which is 29 seconds under the two hat time. So don't feel too bad about that at all, especially considering I felt I was having to explore new logic. Yeah, pretty cool. Like that one. Okay, one more puzzle to go in this video, but I can't record that until tomorrow because I don't know what the puzzle is. See you tomorrow. Okay, and now for the final part. It was going to be the fifth puzzle, but it's not the fifth puzzle because it's the fifth and the sixth because about two minutes ago, Bill Murphy posted two classic Sudoku to be the end of the gas. So here's the message that came with them. I asked at the bookshop if they had some plays written by Shakespeare for purchase. Of course, they said. Which one? William. <sighs> Today's guests are two classic Sudoku. I wonder which bookshop he went to. I'm very familiar with most of the bookshops in Melbourne. Anyway, um, happy 20th birthday to McCluskey Do Dallas. The album rules and you were good at the Corner Hotel last night. I, I, it's been a long time since I've been to the Corner Hotel. Uh, put the digits one to nine, neat road column and box. The times are based on doing both puzzles. If you get a dinosaur, you get a Gath, Gareth, <laughs> a Gareth Brontemeris says. Don't ask. Okay. So the first puzzle is this one called What We've Learned. Um, it's a classic Sudoku. So, yep, um, restarting the puzzle. Let's give this a shot. So we can put a one here. Uh, two goes here. I have um, six is in one of those two. Okay, let's keep looking. One goes here, so I can put one here. Uh, one goes here, which means this is a one. Can I chase twos now? Um, not sure. Two is in one of those two, which means two. Do, 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 do. Not sure. Two is in one of those two. This is just a seven. Which means seven is in one of those two, which means seven is in one of those two. So this is an eight or a nine now. Three is in one of those two. This is a four, seven pair. So these are 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three, eight, and nine. Well, there's no eight there. There's no three there. This is not helping. Um, what am I chasing? Sanity. That's what I'm chasing. Three is in one of those. That's great. Uh, this is a two, six pair. So if that's a two, six pair, these are one, two, three, four, eight, and nine. There's no four or eight there. It's a nine in the center of the grid. So this is a four, eight. Does that do anything for this triple? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three, five, seven. So it's a seven at the top and I can take seven out of both of those. Uh, this is the three, this is the five, this is the three, puts three in one of those two, put five in one of those two. There's no three there, so this is the three. That means this is a triple. One, two, four, five. There's no five in either of those, so that's the five. This is a seven. This is a three by Sudoku. It's all by Sudoku. This is, a, this is not the seven. This is the six. Seven. This is the six. This is an eight or a nine. This is an eight or a nine. Uh, it's all by Sudoku. I don't know why I bother saying that. Need to put a four. Not sure. Four, five, eight, nine. So this is four, eight or nine. It's all about where I'm scanning, isn't it? This is an eight by Sudoku. So this is the five. So one, two, three, four, and nine go into those. So this, this has to be four, nine, doesn't it? Yeah, this isn't an, this is the nine. This is the four. This is the eight. This is the nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight go into those. Okay. These are two, eight, and nine. Yeah. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is the eight. So eight comes out of those. The two, the two nine looks down, making this eight, this nine. This is one, two, three, four, five, six. So six, five. These are a pair. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this three makes this the five, this the three. The eight makes this the four and this the eight. So this is two or nine. That's not it. The four looks down making that the two and that the four. So this is the six. This is the two. The six looks up making this the eight and the six. This column, one, two, three, four, five, six. This is the seven, four, seven. These are nine and eight. So one, two, three, four, and six. So the six makes this the four, this the six, which makes this the nine, this the four. These are two, three, and nine. There's no three in those. That's the three. This is the nine. This is the two. This is the nine. One, two, three, four, five, six. And therefore, this is the nine, and this is the two. So the first one is done in four minutes, 30. This is the second one, which is To Hell With Good Intentions by Bill Murphy. I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. Let's give this one a shot. So these are all the even digits. So this is a 2, 8, and I know the order. This is the 2, this is the 8. These are 4 and 6, and I know the order. 4 and 6. These are 6, 7, 8, 9. So these are 6 and 9, and the 6 makes this the 9 and this the 6. These are therefore 7 and 8, and the 8 here makes this the 7 and this the 8. It's an interesting opening. So these are 1, 2, 3. That's not a 1, that's not a 3. Um, this, these see 1, 2, 6, 7, 8, 9. So these are four, 3, 4, 5. There's no five there. This is weird. This sees one, three, five. So this is two or four. These are all the odd digits. One, three, five, seven, nine. There's no seven, nine in those. There's no one here. There's no five or one or three here. This is very weird. No one, three here. No five here. I'm not sure. This is incredibly weird. Oh, this is now a six by Sudoku.
Is that the only thing I'm getting? Six. Ah, this is a six by Sudoku. So six is in one of those two. These are one, three, five, nine. There's no one or three there. So this is a five, seven, nine triple. So one, two, three, four, five. This is an eight. There's no five there. So one, two, three, four, there's a seven in one of those two. This is very strange. I don't know what I'm doing. I thought it's like, okay, there's a nice flow to the, I don't, I don't get the flow. One and three are in here and they're not in the middle. So this is a one, three pair. There you go. So this is seven or nine. So this is a triple one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, four, eight. And there's no eight there. So the two, four pair makes this the eight. That's cool. These are now one, two, three, four, five. So these are one and five. So one comes out of there. So one is in one. Ah, one is now right here by Sudoku. One is now here by Sudoku. I like this. I don't know that I'm going to do it quickly, but I'm enjoying the puzzle. Five, what's this quadruple? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, four, five. Well, there's no one there because of this. There's no five in those. There's no one or five there. This is two or four. So this is a two, four pair. What? Oh, there's no five here. This is a one or a three. So five is in one of those two, which means this is a five, this is a three, this is a one. This is the five because of the seven, nine. These are one, two, three, two and four. So this is four and two. This is three. There's no three here. This three means this is two, this is four, this is five, this is two, this is four, four comes out of those. This is the two and the one. This is not the five. These are one, two, three, four, five, six, and eight. And these are one, two, three, four, seven, and nine. There's no three there. This is very strange. So this triple, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, and nine. So this is the nine. This is a six, eight. This triple, one, two, three, four, five, six, two, seven, and nine. So this is the seven. This is a two, nine, which means that's not the nine. The two makes this the nine and this the two. There's no seven here. Two is in one of those. Uh, two is here. So this triple, one, two, three, four, five, and seven. There's no seven there. There's no five there. That's the four. Four comes out of those. This is the seven. This is the five, which means this is the one. This is the five, which means this is the three. This is the one. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, three, and nine. So three, nine, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, four, and seven. So four and seven. One, two, three, and eight. So eight and three and six. And one, two, three. Four, five, six, four, and eight, and six, and eight. Three makes this nine and three, which means this is seven, nine, seven, nine. Six minutes and two seconds. So if I add six minutes and two seconds and four minutes 30, that's 10 minutes 32. I did not get a two hat time. I missed out by 32 seconds, but I just missed out by 32 seconds. This one had a lot of weird stuff going on. 
people who are better at classics would have got that. Um, so everyone who posts in the Sudoku uh, Discord channel. But as I said, this video, this puzzle was only released. So how many solvers did this had? Uh, can I click the tick again? Only 36 solvers when I did it. So as you can see, this one is quite new. Um, I'm going to uh, sign off now because this is the final video for my this gas run. So thank you everyone for watching. Please, as always, go check out the gas homepage where there'll be links to all sorts of stuff, in, uh, including other video solvers. Um, check out the gas uh, in, and the gas YouTube page where the people who create the puzzles do demonstration solves of, um, of their puzzles themselves. Um, and uh, yeah, as always, good luck with your solving.